Hello guys, today I'm gonna be making some Jamaican curry chicken and I'm gonna add a little Indian twist to it. Alright? So here I've got one small chicken. I washed it and cut it up in, into small pieces like this. Alright, this is fresh chicken and here um, I've got some onions, some tomatoes, as I said I'm going to use a little Indian twist to it today, uh, usually Jamaicans won't put tomato, so um, I'm going to add some tomato because I want to make it a little different. And here I've got some scotch garnet pepper and over here I've got some scallions and some garlic, some thyme, and some crushed ginger. And of course, some salt, all right? I'm gonna use one teaspoon of salt. Now let's take a look at the dry seasoning I'm gonna be using. Here, I've got some Jamaican mixed seasoning. I'm not sure of the names, but in the middle, I added a little allspice powder, all right? So if you don't have these seasonings, you can use whatever you have at home. Okay, let's sprinkle on the chicken. And then we're gonna dump all of the Jamaican dry seasoning in. Oh, by the way, I also added a little chili powder, Indian chili powder, because I wanna have like a fusion taste to it. All right. And now I'm just gonna add a little of the seasoning here because I wanna fry it up later. A little garlic and ginger. Just a little. A little thyme. Um, I can add most of the scallions. of the onions and very important Jamaican curry right I'm gonna add like a teaspoon and later I'm gonna add some more when I'm frying the um, fresh seasoning and of course a teaspoon of turmeric powder and a little oil and let's mix it up now And of course, I'm going to add some potato later. Okay. Look at this. Smells so good. Now I'm going to marinate this for at least an hour. And I'll come back and show you how to, to cook it. See you later. Okay, now let's pan fry the chicken for a little. Just to get it a little color. Let's add some oil to the pan.
going to just rub it a little. Look at the color so beautiful. Yeah. Let's just saute it for a while. As I said, this is what I'm looking for. Just a little brown on it. Now I'm going to remove this chicken and I'm going to stir fry the fresh veggies. And then I'm going to add the onions and I'm going to sweat it for a little. Sauce. As you can see, the onion is cooking now, it's becoming translucent. I'm going to add a little more of the Jamaican curry powder. About a teaspoon. Let's keep sweating the onion until it's cooked properly. Now I can add the tomatoes, the garlic, and the ginger and the thyme. Let's now add a little water and the scotch bonnet pepper and cook it down for a little while. Cover it again for five more minutes. Let's check and see after five minutes. So guys you could just add the chicken here and some water and cook it for half an hour and that should be perfectly fine 
but I don't like the chunky bits so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use a mini blender and blend it up into a paste and let you see what it looks like so this is what it looks like a paste so I'm gonna add a little water get out all this goodness from the blender Let's bring it up to a boil because we added a little water. I'm going to add a little more turmeric powder. Give it some color. And we're going to cook this light for five minutes. Okay, I've cooked it down for five minutes and this is what it should look like. See? And now we can add our chicken. And then we can add our potatoes. some water okay that should be enough and now we are gonna cover this and let it cook for about half an hour so I'll see you then okay guys it has been half an hour and my chicken is almost ready let's take a look and see what it looks like look at that and now I'm gonna taste it and see if it needs any more salt mm. super duper yummy that's it it is ready beautiful switch it off now and let's plate it up And you can garnish with a little coriander. You don't have to, but I like to. Look at that. Kidoki, it's time for me to try. Mmm, so yummy. So there you have it, Jamaican curry chicken. You can serve this with a bowl of rice or maybe the naan bread that I taught you how to make. Or you can eat it with whatever you like. Thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you will like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye.